We're back at it with the world's strongest trampoline, yeah. and here's the lineup today, everyone. Hi ho, Silver Willie. Oh, that's my hit. There's comfort. <laughs> there's washing. There's that food. And there's vending machine. It weighs as much as the car. <laughs> Heck, everyone, yeah. will it bounce? Before we get into today's episode, I'm here with Rexy. We want to let you know about something really special that's going on at the moment that you can get involved in. So. About a month ago, a good friend of ours, Ben, was diagnosed with motor neuron disease, or ALS. Super crazy, life-transforming diagnosis. Ben's a dad, he's got three boys between the ages of 12 and 8. He's married to uh, Emma, he's the high school teacher, so he's the primary earner for the family. They're amazing people, they're foster carers, they run a junior basketball club for over 20 teams. So this is where you can help. A GoFundMe page has been set up, as you see behind me. The link is in the description. There's currently four 444 donors and I feel like that is a sign that the 44 club we can get involved and we can really blow that target out of the water we want them to make some special family memories while Ben's still able to but also help them out into the future into the unknown that they're going to be facing so please give generously let's make a real difference thanks so much in advance for what you're going to give and now onto the video oh <laughs> Got ya. Oh. I knew I would. I actually knew I would. I was like, they're going the rock oh. again. Yeah! Herons up at top, everyone. Take those mint shorts of yours and move them. You're going in the wrong way. It's up there. Can I just say, everybody deserves a Rexy. And the truth is, not everyone got a Rexy last time we set No, they didn't. 444 went in two hours. You're like, there's quite a You didn't have the bell people. on, you were cooked. <laughs> Very cooked. In fact, if you we lived in the UK, you Unless you're up at 1 a.m., yeah. <laughs> but we're getting more, all right? Getting more we're getting a lot more. So you guys can all have the chance to get a bit more Rexy in your life. How good. In other news, there's a lazy boy ascending the tower. I don't know if you remember this, but we <laughs> have dropped go. a lazy boy on an original trampoline a while oh, yeah. ago. Oh, flip. Oh, oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> trampoline, you're stuffed. <laughs> Look at this thing. Do you reckon we can still get it to yeah. work? Oh no worries mate! <laughs> this thing's all G! Let's see how we go with this one. Because if we middle it, we could get the old lazy boy bouncy. No, you're right. The Stanford, lazy bounce. Stanford, we're standing on a nest of ants. <laughs> and these water balloons on the ground, they're not ours! So stop commenting them! Flip Heron! Yo boys! I don't know, I just felt like I needed to yell your name. <laughs> There's nothing like letting a big hair in out. <laughs> I'm telling you. I'm about ready to drop. Do they need a clean? Or am I pretty squeaky? Yeah. Anyone a fan of tuna mornay? Eh? It's been a while for me. Heron, how's the wind situation? Yeah, I'm probably gonna give it a little push out to be Frank Stanford. We're good, mate. Send down the lazy boy. Alright, let's go in three, two, one. Oh, it's it away. Oh. It's away. Oh. <laughs> That's bone crunching. <laughs> that has just, just wedged. Gaunton, I can say without a shadow of a doubt, no bounce. I can also say without a shadow of a doubt, the steel won that. <laughs> that has absolutely shazammed it, hasn't it? Can you push him out? That would be with the GoPro? Oh. Effective. Can he still give you comfort? That's the real question. I mean, it's a permanent lazy. <laughs> oh, that's actually really good. Very dangerous spot to be laying down though. There are a lot of bees kicking about. <laughs> I think I can, they're a fan of the melon. I can freaking hear them. Bye bye. Stanford, you're not going to believe what just happened then. Get the bell on! So the couch is rigged up. Thanks, Mike, for that. Just everyone say hi to Mike. Hello, Mike. Hello, James. Right in the middle. Oh, jeez. He might be slipping. No, 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 no. I know Rexy. He'll hold on. He will. I'll make him hold on. Lingardian Leviosa. So, fun fact about this couch. It's actually my old roommate's couch. So, had a few naps on this thing. Had a bit of a history. Watched a lot of NBA off it. Always sat with the dog a little bit. Really appreciated its service. But, you know, you move on to bigger and better things in life. And this couch probably isn't. Unless this goes well. The real question is, did Heron learn anything? I don't reckon he'll be able to talk to us because of the winch, but I'm going to ask him stuff anyway. Hey Heron, have you learned any lessons? 
Are you talking to me? Can't hear a thing! Did you learn anything from that drop? Megaphone! Hey, it doesn't matter what you say. Heron, <laughs> you're a big girl's blouse. Nah, I can't hear anything. Heron, listen to me, mate. Be quiet. Did you learn anything from your last drop? Yeah, I need to go this way. It could take a second person to hold it. Roger that. So we're going the kick and release approach. It's a new one. Yeah, we got James actually pushing from below. Righto, Heron, we're good for you. Kick and release, here we go. Flip me. All right. Oh, heck. Could go at any moment. It's oh, down. it's gone. It's down. Oh. Chronicles of Narnia. That was something. It did sort of bounce. And is it still good? That did not at all go to the plan. It's flipping released on me. We didn't even get to kick it. What the heck? I reckon we could potentially sell this. I actually can't see any damage. I mean, Can you? Some good inspecting <laughs> with the GoPro stick. That's probably still rolling, isn't it? Hey! <laughs> Red Isaac, son of David, come in. Would you believe it? But I don't think there's like any damage to the couch. Yeah, right on. How was the boing? Probably rocked a maximum meter and a half. <laughs> that's that's underwhelming. The Pepsi, everyone, you've got to understand that is 300 plus kilograms. It's gonna be big, but for now, washing machine and oh, I've got to put the washing in. I just figured if we wanted to add a little more weight, putting in all heavy clothes was a good idea. Oh yeah. Yeah. Another 30, I reckon. Over the weekend, I laid some new turf. It just got like a really small patch just for the dog. Like, laid it beautifully, really dug it out and sunk it down. Anyway, just got news through. He's already pulled up a patch. Flushing machines almost reached the summit. Gonson, let's yeah. talk contest, because I know you're a bit iffy about it at the moment. So I've got one this week, which I think you'll appreciate. I just want everyone out there to just comment something they think will make us laugh. And Gaunson, you of all people will pick the one that makes you laugh the most. Yeah. That's and okay. and I'll, I'll feel it. I'll, um, sorry. Yeah, <laughs> I've really butchered that, haven't I? <laughs> <laughs> this is what Scott will do. also just be fantastic if those sausages started cooking themselves and we could eat them shortly. Self-cooking sausages, surely that can't be far off. Mark Rober, any ideas? I mean everyone knows a washing machine, yep. but does everyone know a, like a washing machine? It wasn't meant to make sense. It didn't. <laughs> How are we looking up there, D-Train? Rigging up something to hold this thing! Are you guys good? Drop it like it's hot! Three! Two, one. Washing's out, washing's out, washing's out, washing's out. Oh, how low! Goodness gracious frog. Stanford, that was a heavy tumble cycle, I reckon. It's got a warranty. My initial assessment is that the washing actually looks dirtier than when it went in. So up next in the things you never thought you'd see bounce category, the humble fridge. You couldn't do an empty fridge and we need to weigh it down. Oh. Stamper, put him on the top here. I'm gonna strap him This? Down. Yeah. Lots of beverages, you never know when you might have someone over and they want a coldie. Pumpkin. Or a biggie. It's really not the healthiest fridge. Ready to drop. Ah! Oh. Oh. Gaunson's. Ah! We have dropped a fridge from the top of this place. It wasn't quick released, it was like hoiked off. Three, two, one, go! Oh! Oh! <laughs> Had some ripper ideas over the years. <laughs> I don't know if that was a sneeze or a cough. Hey guys, there, Helen! Yes, I am well, thank you, Scott. Is it well with your soul? It is well, it is well, with my soul. 
Come on, get us go, Eagles! <laughs> if you got that, you're most likely Australian. If you did not, you are most likely. Hey! The elongated melon on top is my favourite part. To be fair, I haven't seen it inside, but it's hard to beat a melon on top of a fridge. Gornson's lost the plot. Every step you take, I see the fridge. It has a watermelon. How are you boys looking? Oh, great, until Brett just stepped in front of me. Yeah, we're pretty good, eh? All right, let's do it, everybody. Fridge versus trampoline in three, two, one. Oh, flip. Three, two, Gee. Out. It's out, it's out, oh, it's, it's out. Flipping. Good news, Bridget Tramp. Bad news, Heron has hit himself in the scone with the quick release. But um, I think it looked cool. Didn't see it personally. He was recoiling in pain. What could possibly go possibly wrong? Possibly be a little shaken up. And drink quick. Drink quick. Oh. Yeah, nah. <laughs> the pumpkin is intact completely. In the fridge. It was in the fridge. Now it's out of the fridge. What do you reckon about that, Editor Jack? Wow. <laughs> So let's get this thing out, let's get vending machine in. Big old Pepsi, weighs probably at least triple the fridge. Oh, easy. Hello, boys and girls. There he goes, big Pepsi. She is an absolute stunner. Let's not forget she's also a heavyweight. How high can it bounce? Can we touch the ground? No, I don't reckon. Mark said exponentially more force required to get it lower at the yeah, lower it Mark, goes. Mark, so he, he's no, smart, he we're not. I'm just gonna back him in. Vending machine versus indestructible trampoline let's flip and do it this could be the last hurrah for the trampoline let's see how we go hopefully heron can hit it all right derek Hectic. drop the pepsi please bounce you beautiful beverage machine here we go in three two one. Oh, baby big oh yes three, gee two, one. oh it's oh, falling Creepers, creepers! What a massive bounce! Phenomenal, it has bounced it! Stanford, look at this thing! Oh, was that like that before? Look at that bend! Tramp did things then, remarkable things. That ridge there definitely wasn't like that before. For steel to do that, but for Kevlar to be like this, do you know what I mean? Like that's... Yeah, it's impressive stuff. Not sure if we did a full-on damage report of the vending machine, but as you can see, it's probably not gonna go back in the office. That's a lot of damage. There's anything we haven't done with this trampoline and you want to see? Probably now's the time to comment. Mm. I think they've got two choices. Oh, okay, some videos to watch. Yeah, either you're going to watch the playlist of the whole Bang Lot series with this tramp, yep. or you're going to watch the last video we did with the tramp, which I don't know what it is, but it'll be really good. Yeah, no, watch that. <laughs> Cheers, 44 Club. We'll see you around.